Hey everybody, it's Jonathan Mayer. It's been a while, but I am back with another Pro Wrestling Crate unboxing. Uh, this is for the month of September 2024, and its reference today is Monday, September 23rd. Uh, the reason it's been a while, as you probably know, this year, 2024, they made this an every other month, a bi-monthly crate. So we're still getting two micro brawler, or excuse me, we used to get one micro brawler every crate, but now we're getting two, kind of the equivalent of over that two month span. Uh, still getting two t-shirts, we're still getting an autograph, and then some other things thrown in as well. Uh, it's a mystery box, costs about $40 a month. Um... Let's just go ahead and crack into it here. I'm, I am going to go over who we expect. Let's see. So it's always a mystery. I hope you've watched my videos before. If, if you haven't, if you just now stumbled across me, thank you so much. Um, if at the end of this video, you liked it enough, maybe subscribe to my channel. I've got probably 60 of these videos over the last four years. Um, I also do the All Elite Crates. That's a quarterly crate. So we're getting that four times a year. We're getting this one six times a year. But in this crate, we're going to expect something from... And this is kind of like our uh, Halloween masks and paint crate because we're not going to get one next month because of that every other month thing. So we're going to get something from Ultimate Warrior, The Hardys, Danhausen, Road Warriors, Max Moon, Gangrel, Mustafa Ali, Revolting Blob, and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Wrestlers. So let's see what we got here. I think they did tell us what the Danhausen item is going to be. It's like it's like a mask of his which I'm not sure exactly what I'll do with that if that's the case, but, you know, we, we love that Danhausen. So um, let's go ahead and crack it open here and see what we got. Cut the tape with my handy dandy uh, little cutter that my mom gave me specifically for unboxings. Shout out to my mom. Okay, let's get in here. Okay, right on top, we've got our card that's going to go over who we expect in the next crate. Uh, it's also going to give us a table of contents. So you try to not look at one side because you don't, you want to be surprised as you pull these things out. So the first thing that we've got is a shirt here. I can see that both shirts are black. Pretty common. Okay, first shirt. It is colorful right away. Oh, I like that. I like it. It's Ultimate Warrior. It's like, you know, kind of a, a picture of him almost like it's a broken mirror. I was thinking Ultimate Warrior when he looked in that mirror one time and saw Hogan, but I don't think it's supposed to be that, but it's just a cool warrior design. I like it. In the middle here, between the shirts, we have a sticker. I can always find something to put a sticker on. Okay, now we, we've gotten some of these actual balls. It's been a while, um, but this is a sticker representation of those little mad balls, those brawler balls that we were getting. That's Road Warrior Animal there. On the ball itself, like the other side, was Hawk. So kind of a gross-out little sticker there, you know, Halloween. I'll throw that somewhere. Okay, next up, we've got another black t-shirt. I can tell right away it's really cool looking. I love that. It, that this is cool. It says, Teenage Mutant Ninja Wrestlers. Now, honestly, I never was a Ninja Turtle guy. I was, maybe I'm just a tad too old for that, I guess. Um, but this is super cool. I will definitely wear that. Okay, next up we have our first micro brawler. I can see both micro brawlers here and they're very nice. I did not get a chase. There's always a chance at a chase. There's less of those made, kind of a different colorway. Um, we'll open these up when we circle back around. But first off, we've got Chicago's own Mustafa Ali. And go right to the next micro brawler because it's here. Um, a lot of us know this guy as Conan or K-Dog. We've got Max Moon. Now, if there's ever a toyetic micro brawler, that's one right there. We'll pop both of those open when we circle back around. Uh, let's see what else we got in here. Oh, I talked about those brawler balls. We actually do have one. And let's see if we can figure out who it... Okay, well, it says right on it. It's Matt and Jeff, the Hardys. So it's going to be kind of gross, probably. There's, I mean, I guess it's like the inside of Matt's face if the skin was pulled off. So who knows exactly what that looks like. But it says delete on top. So you know that's Matt. And then the other side, I thought it was Jeff already, but you can see some face paint. I guess even when you rip the skin off, you get a little face paint there. 
Um, but these are just kind of a squeezy little stress ball. I'll hold on to this when I'm doing some work. Okay, I see that mask that uh, that I talked about. Um, fine, maybe I should buy one of those little styrofoam heads and put it on there. I thought about that because I have a couple other masks. Maybe. Okay, we've got a Danhausen mask. I'll go ahead and pop this open right now. We have a couple items left here, but we're we're about done. Use that handy dandy knife to get me in here. Okay. So it's a wrestling mask and it is Danhausen's face. Now, am I gonna wear that out and about? I mean, no, but maybe I'll get that little thing to put it on. Maybe I'll stick it in this drawer and not do anything with it, but I do love Danhausen. Uh, I've had some personal interactions. I'd like to call him, you know, a friend of mine. Um, that's, you know, Danhausen mask. We've got a lot of Danhausen things. We knew it probably wasn't gonna be another micro brawler. How many micro brawlers can we get? I'm sure there'll, there'll probably be more, but okay. Okay, let's get through this. Uh, okay, I don't actually know what movie this is from, which I know there's a lot of things here where I say, I haven't seen that movie. I didn't watch that show. Maybe I'm not quite as cool as, as, as I think I am, but uh, we've got The Revolting Blob. I do know that's from like a movie or a TV show. I heard the people talking about it, but it's just a pen, which I'd probably prefer it to be a pen since I'm not real familiar with, with that. But I'll stick it up on one of my pen boards I got around here. All right, last but not least, and then we'll circle back around, we've got our autographed 8x10. Now, you'll hear me say a lot that if you go through that list, maybe you can figure out by this point who this is, but there's a lot of people on that list and I can't really remember at this point. So let's crack it open here and see what we got. Oh yeah, we've got, he's fanging and banging, Gangrel. He's still out there wrestling today. I've seen him wrestle a few times in the last couple of years over at Squared Circle Expo. That is Gangrel. We've got, I feel like, we had an autograph from him previously, but I don't think so. It was just that micro brawler that we had. My friend Phantom up in Canada, huge fan of Gangrel. So maybe this will make its way up to Canada. Uh, let's circle back around here and, and just see what we got. We'll pop open these micro brawlers. So there was our Gangrel 8x10. We had our Hardee's uh, brawler ball, little stress ball here. A little Kind of like those gross out uh, mad balls, I think they were called back in the day. No guts squeeze out of this. It's just kind of a, a foam stress ball. Uh, we have a revolting blob pen. I, there's also a chase version of the pen. Um, I did not get the chase version. We have our sticker here. The, the brawler ball version of the Road Warriors sticker. Okay, now we've got our micro brawlers. First off, Mustafa Ali. Like I say, he is from Chicago. He was in WWE, but he is on the independence now, making the rounds. That's It's very cool. That looks just like what his entrance gear looks like, and he wears that mask and has a little thing on his hand. Uh, ba on the back of it, I mean, it's not just plain, but it's, you know, kind of the back of his thing. Some lines and, and designs there. Okay. And we do have a collector card on the back of these. You can cut these out, share it with your friends, you know, make a coaster out of it or, or something. I've done several things with these. Uh, okay, next up we have Max Moon, also has the collectible card. Um, I, I usually mention as well, I haven't mentioned yet today, this is resealable packaging. So you can take this out, but then you can seal it right back up again and, you know, hang it on the wall or whatever you want to do with it. Okay, Max Moon here. That is cool. So many small little details. So many deco hits, as uh, us and the us nerd toy nerds say. But look at that! All those little deco hits on the the pants, and then on the back, he had like some tassels that came out of the back of this mask here. That is very cool. I love a colorful. I I just love things that are colorful in general. A good colorful micro brawler will look good up here. I'm getting to the point where on this display, I have to start bumping people. Um, Somebody's gonna get bumped for Max Moon, likely. Okay, uh, we had our mask, love that Danhausen mask. And then we've got our t-shirts here. Here's our warrior shirt, ultimate warrior. That is very cool. And our Teenage Mutant Ninja Wrestlers. 
I really like that. I, I mean, this, like I say, I like things that are colorful. That's nice. And it's a black shirt, but it's got a nice colorful graphic that pops. All right, that's everything. Now let's look at what they call these things and see what we're expecting next month. And then I'll get you out of here. Maybe you can go watch some other video. Uh, I know my friend Dave Canning, he does videos sometimes, not every time, um, but he's on his honeymoon right now. He just got married. Congratulations, Dave. Uh, got a message from him this morning that Matt Cardona was in like the seat in front of him on his plane down to Orlando. So that's pretty cool. Uh, congratulations. But a lot of people do these videos. Check out some of the others. Pro Wrestling Tees does them and you can see what those chases look like if you would like. Um, Okay, so that Ultimate Warrior t-shirt is called Portrait. Uh, just the Teenage Mutant Ninja Wrestlers t-shirt is what that one's called. So if you want to find these, I mean, I'm sure some of these people, some of these will end up on eBay. People flip these boxes. So go search for those names if you want to buy any of this stuff. I don't sell mine. I, I enjoy it and I like to keep it. But uh, we have our Max Moon Micro Brawler. There was 250 chases of that. Uh, same with the Mustafa Ali Micro Brawler. Uh, the Revolting Blob Pen. There was 100 chase versions of that. Then we have our Gangrel autographed 8x10, the Hardy's Brawler Ball, our Danhausen Lucha Mask, the Road Warrior Animal Brawler Ball Sticker, and they give you a code here for 20% uh, off your next order. And the, the people that they're anticipating, we don't know everyone that's in the next crate, um, but we're going to get something again in November. Uh, we'll get an All Elite crate before then, but in November, the theme is Parodies and More. And we're going to get something from Joe Hendry. Um, I'm not quite sure if I believe in Joe Hendry or not. I, maybe I will. I don't know. Uh, the Grinch, uh, Marty McFly, Darth Vader, MJF, and more. So that ought to be interesting to see what, what that entails. But thank you so much for taking your time to watch this video. If you liked it, maybe throw a like on this video. Subscribe if you haven't. And we'll see you next time. Peace.